I did not expect it to be this soon, but spooky season has arrived. And with spooky season comes new maps, new cosmetics, and new taunts. As always, we're going to do an unboxing video. But first, we're going to check out the new items in the item shop. So we're going to take a look at the new items which are in the item shop, and then we shall do our unboxing. First of all, we've got the scaredy cat. It's just a scared bloke. <laughs> Not sure what there is to, to really talk about there. He's just scared. And that is an all class, so every class is terrified. Can't see what the scout is though. Chanty shipmate. Now this is for the demo man. I think this is um, his vehicle taunt. Every class is getting a vehicle taunt. So this is the demo man's, it seems. Very cool. It does seem on brand for the dead man, given he, you know, he has an eye patch and everything. So you know what? I like it. Now we've got the Texas Twirlum. Damn, the engine got some moves. Oh my gosh. Look at him go. Wow. That's pretty cool. That's a pretty cool one. Not for me personally, but I can see what engineer means. Would like that one. Then we've got another... <laughs> Another demo man taunt here, wow. They really do be liking the demo man, huh? Ah, so this is like the soldier's tank. The demo man has a cannon. And that, that thing is moving, holy shit. I'm guessing if you click, it would shoot. He looks very pleased with it though. <laughs> and finally, the travel agent. <laughs> what is that image? Oh my god. This is... Uh... Quite the, I can't really see it because of how big the actual taunt is. But that, that's pretty cool. <laughs> that's probably the coolest one we've got this update. I rate it. I do rate it. Obviously there's war paints. Not really fuss about war paints. What we're for, what we're here for is the ghoulish gains. Let's have a look. Oh, what's in here? I'm going to start from the bottom, work our way up. Well, I'm, I like this one. This is a cool cosmetic. I saw it in the workshop. I'm whether I use it or not is up for debate, but looks cool. This, I like this actually. Right, it's not a horror cosmetic really, it just looks nice. <laughs> Which is good, you know, I might... I could actually use this if I if I wanted. Oh, now this has horror elements to it, but it is a very nice sniper cosmetic. And now I'm at a crossroads because there are many nice sniper body cosmetics and I can't use them all. <laughs> and this one, this one is one of them now. Oh, we'll have to see what I can make. Not really a fan of this one, it just looks like modern fashion which doesn't really work within the universe of TF2. But then again, there's some crazy shit in TF2, so maybe it does work. But for me, not really a fan. I am a fan of this though, oh my god. I like the soldier coat we got, that was very cool. And now this one as well. And this is amazing, and I, and I got that buy cosmetic from the last update as well. Ah oh man, they're really bringing out some bangers. <laughs> not really a fan of this, um, just, that's all I'm going to say. This one's cool, but... I don't think I'd use it. This one is very cool. I like this one a lot. Similar to the Pyro one, which is like the, the uh, mage guy from Final Fantasy or something. This hat, very cool. It looks like it's for the scout, so I'm not sure I'll use it that much, but it's a very cool model nonetheless. This one's cool. Little fire hat for the, the soldier. Don't think I'll use it though. Who is this for? Soldier? No, Demo Man, surely. It looks amazing, whoever it's for. Wow. Not so cool, but decent. Not really a fan of the mask cosmetics in general, to be honest. Eh, fits the uh, fireman's loadout. Hmm, Mad Max vibes for heavy, I want to say. Not really for me. This is nice. It's like a more modernised version of Medic's lab coat. Pretty cool. This one's actually quite decent. This one is actually very cool, and I can see a lot of edgy soldier means using this one, but in all fairness to them, it is a nice cosmetic. Oh, come on. Alcoholic Automaton. This is like an up updated version of the, the demo part, and I like it. I like it. Road Rage is also very cool. I reckon it's for the heavy to go with that Mad Max set. Nice. Victorian villainy. You know what? A little Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde vibe. I can get behind it. Whoa, this is actually quite cool. I feel like he already has a similar cosmetic though. And then the Omni... Oh, wow. That is a very... Is that a spy cosmetic? That is, that is very crazy. Nice, not bad cosmetics in this case actually. N none of the ones I looked at in my previous video, but still look pretty good. 
Let's unbox then, but first, we got a Manko package, as always. What are we gonna get? A Frontier Justice. <laughs> Brilliant. Let's go on to the proper unboxing now. And we'll just 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 start with this one, I guess. See what we can uh we can unlock. Two items. Cream spirit, okay, they both look yellow to me, but who do, what do I know? Oh, fair enough. We got the lavish lab labware. I think if you want to do like a, a low key medic loadout, that'd work well for it. But he's got so many nice lab coats, I don't know if it really gets a look in, to be honest. Don't move to the second case. Two items again. A name tag. Very nice. And. Beaten and bruised. Okay. A cosmetic I was not really a fan of. I'm not going to let that take away from the unbox. I'm sure it looks fine on the soldier, just not ready for me. I'm going to go to the end one, you know, M mix it up a bit, see if we can <laughs> jumble up the unboxings. Okay, we got some more paint, a colour similar to slate. Three items, oh shit, okay. Backpack expander. And the horror shawl. You know what? Part of me thought it would be an unusual, but the backpack expander ruined it. <laughs> Let's see what's in this one then. One item in this one. Headhunter's Brim said I wasn't really a fan, and you know, it still stands. Not really a fan of that cosmetic. Let's see if we can get anything. Any any bangers, come on. Ah, just as I said that, we got one. I like this cosmetic. I have to mess around with my sniper loadouts and see if I can make it work. Because it is very cool, but I have a feeling I might not be able to, which is a shame. Come on, give me something good. Ah, shit. <laughs> oh! We are the Imps imprint. Oh, a strange part. That'd be good for like a classic, I think. And uh, let's see what's in this next one then. All right. Wait, what? That wasn't even on the, the case. Is this one of the like Halloween items, I guess? Mad, okay. Oh, and we get the spy coat. I think in terms of like cool items, that was definitely the best case we've had. I didn't even know this was in the game. Wow, okay. So there are some sneaky cosmetics in here that I didn't see. Obviously it's Halloween, so there are going to be some Halloween exclusive items. It makes sense, I just didn't think to look for them. Very cool. Alright, we're going to try the last three here. So, no unusuals yet. Oh, look at that though. That's cool. You can finally find out what class that's for. Demo Man. So I was right. He kind of has some pilgrimy sort of loadouts, so makes sense. But it's a very cool cosmetic. Again, I'm happy with the loadouts I have, so I don't know if I can implement these cool cosmetics into the loadouts. Man, it's it's pain. Onto our penultimate case. Multiple items, could it be? What the fuck is... <laughs> okay, we got a bear cosmetic for the heavy. And the firefighter. The firearm protector. Not bad. And finally, the last case. The last chance to get a funny purple text hat. Let's hope. Let's hope it is. It's not. It's not. No, it wasn't. But it is a decent engineer hat. So we take that, I guess. Not a great unboxing, personally. We did get some cool cosmetics, though, which is is nice to see. Uh, I'm not sure if I can make the ones work that I want them to work, but we'll find out. Some decent unboxes, but really, nothing to really write home about. No funny, unusual hat, which is a shame, because that's what you want. Hmm, I've been over the giant tree. This has been the Scream Fortress unboxing. Very nice cosmetics in this update. They smashed it. Uh, barely any of the ones I looked at in my review video previously, but <laughs> we move. Very cool nonetheless. And yeah, my next video will be on the maps, so watch out. Hey, oh, uh. Uh, I've been up for like two hours. Two hours. Yo, bitch can feel took a few showers. Few showers. I don't buy my just money dance. Yeah. That wristwatch costs a hundred grand.